Hey everybody, I'm Nigger from here, and welcome back to Moonlighter. It's been a while since I've played this, I, I have to admit. It, is, it has been a while. Uh, so I'm probably going to be pretty rusty here. And I'm going to kind of have forgotten where we are. But that's okay. That is a-okay. Do, 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 do. Man, it's taking a while to load. Okay, so, uh, grand scheme of things here. Come on. You can do it. You can load. I believe in you. I guess this is why I should just wait. And until I'm into the game to start recording. All right. Oh gosh, we have to figure everything out. Man, okay, we need to sell some stuff. Oh wow, I can make that. Right, that's all headgear, isn't it? Can make that too. Right, I've got a lot of money to spend. I haven't made this yet, really? I wish I wanted enchantments. It's not even that unreasonable. Upgrade our damage by 25. Give us more defense. Actually, just give us defense at all. Alright, so... Oh, good. I was accidentally hitting the right trigger, and it didn't let me use any of my health potions. We also can upgrade the shop. Oh man, I don't know. I feel like we could buy those without trying very difficult, but should we get the banker? Let's just get the banker. Let's just see what he does. Okay, he he built we built a banker. Yes, I'm Edward, a new assistant in this marble town of Renoka. I like to call myself a broker. I deal in capital, making your gold work for you. Invest in business ventures, and I'll make you a rich man. I'm busy with other business at the moment. Come back in two days, and we'll talk again. Okay. I guess I don't really need these. I just don't know what any of this stuff is worth. I think that's my problem right now. But I guess that means we might as well start selling. Yeah, we don't know what any of this stuff is worth. We know the volcanic stone's worth at least 100. Everything else is a mystery. 
So I guess we just start selling things one at a time. Wait, where's the fire gem in here? Do we have any volcanic stone? No. Flammable dust is pretty low. So let's do it at like 120. Soldering iron seems pretty valuable. I'm already selling some flammable dust. No, I wanted to see it first. I don't know. 400? I missed what that person was looking for. A book, I think. No, stop doing that. I need. I'm hitting the wrong buttons. Like I, I need to just do them one at a time, and just experiment with prices, just to see what happens. I don't think I have enough time. Well, that was a good deal, whatever that was. Oh, those are the seeds. I need more frames of reference, is really what's going on here. I missed if you thought this was a good deal or not. Basically, I'm putting everything down as 400 or 500, it seems. But now I completely understand why that sale box is so nice. Yeah, sorry, I got nothing in the sale box. I really do need to put some stuff in there. Well, that's good to know. No, just one. And 400 was too low, so let's go up to six, which means that this, which is above the desert stone, should also go up to seven. And we'll take one of these, which was also too low at 400, and put it up with the resistant glass at 700. That got more popular, so its price went up. Let's see, where's a fire gem in the grand scheme of things? It's below that, which hasn't sold yet, but it's also below that, so it's. Let's try 400. Okay, 100 is too good for that. It's good to know. Alright, so that hasn't registered yet, I bet. So, or 120, let's put it at 150. I don't know if you have to sell it before it registers as... Really, I should just be selling the whole lot of them. Even if I'm selling them for too cheap, I'm going to sell things way too slowly. Oh my gosh, everything is... I'm selling everything dirt cheap. $700 is too cheap for that. 
No. Ah, I wanted to check it. All right. So probably more than 400. Let's try 500. I should change that to six. Actually, that just got sold, or that's getting sold for six. So, and that was a good deal, so. Oh, that's right, this person's a stealer. Oh, whoops, I'm already selling that. Whatever. Pretty sure... Oh, that never sold. It's gotta be at least 600, though. Jerk. Guess that was the price I was going to sell it at before. Still a good deal. I need to put stuff in the sale box. Oh, no, no, no. Want to sell for 500, which because there's 10 of them puts it at 5,000. I'm not crazy. Go away, dude. He just did a mustache. Shit, like, I don't know what that means, man. Like, I just, I don't know what that means. Alright, we sold a bunch of stuff. It's pretty good. Yeah, we can put a whole bunch of this stuff in the sale. Not that many. All the not so valuable stuff. These are the those are the valuable things. These like oh, I always still have old stuff. All right, well. I think I go ahead and upgrade the shop to level two. Expansion. Like nothing changed. Phew, that was hard work. Still not trusting me? Remember, it is bigger on the inside. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, people can take orders. No, you can have expensive things in glass cases. Oh, when they're really... popular.
Okay. Um... There's high demand for Golem History 3. And for these... Oh my gosh, for like all of these things, there's high demand. Because I'm not selling them. Actually, that's what I should do. Oh, I don't have enough money for that. I was gonna say I need to. I need to just pour some money into. Oh gosh, we've got more chests now. That's goal mystery one. I don't know, I'm taking a guess here. Wait, where'd everything in my sale bin go? Okay, it's all still there, it's just not showing. Thank you for freaking me out, game. These roots and leaves being wanted will go away. I'm trying to sell that for 150. So let's try and sell this for, whoopsie, 130. I never actually sold these, did I? Probably don't want to sell those, though. Alright, let's go. Oh, that's right. We probably have new things. We can now get this for 70,000. 40% extra tip. That is probably worth buying uh, because it's income. And just like this is probably worth buying just because it makes things, you get 15% more. 75 to 60% off. It's not actually 15% more. It's actually 25 to 40. So it's almost 50. It's almost, wait. Yeah, it's almost 50% more. Because you're getting 25% of the cost, you're getting 40% of the cost, which is almost double. Sorry, yeah, almost double. It's more than 50% more. Anyway. Now that all these guys are here, I'm, I'm really curious to see what the banker does. But we gotta go a-fighting. This is where things are gonna go ugly, because I'm gonna die. That's weird. Wait, Golem Desert Forest. Okay, it's weird that it's called a desert dungeon. It's not what I would have guessed it was called. We do need to improve our, our gear. Like that's something we really have to do. And I think I need to, I'm going to focus on that. I think we've upgraded the shop a good bit. I think it's time to focus on our gear. Although I think I do want to get that cash register before I do. 
We also don't have any potions, so bear that in mind. We're going to pretty much have just a little bit of a shot at this. God, I have to remember what all these enemies do. This is a window into the tech dungeon. They seem like easy enemies. Okay, this guy's literally warping the fabric of reality around him. That Oh no, that's just this dungeon. That's weird. Alright. We got some cool new resources that we won't have seen any other place. Oh my gosh. Oh no. I call bullshit. My controller disconnected and so I died. Okay, I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna get new batteries. Where are my new batteries? Or what, why did it disconnect? Because the batteries, it's not spinning like I don't have batteries. Oh boy. Just like an achievement to not have that many deaths. And I'm trying to keep it that way, but that was not my fault. I still might have died in there, but... Predictable. Yeah, you can totally predict what those guys are going to roll. I hate this enemy, man. I hate this enemy. Holy crap, let me out. You can't swing at them is the problem. You can't swing at them. They they get past your swing. So I don't know how to deal with them. Like, bow and arrow is the only answer, and that's not a good answer. Let's be honest. I really need to improve my gear. Enchanting it to get an extra defense seems like a really good... It's having fun over there, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do this. Ok. 
pretty sure this is more valuable than these, so. Excuse me? Okay, well, we found the way out. It's good to know. It's good to have. Gotcha. All right, now now we're gonna. Oh. Okay, that could have gone a couple different ways. Okay, it's still just these guys. I still don't think I've yet to see them. There we go. It's like I've yet to see them attack. Nothing. Oh. Alright, we still have a little bit of dungeon to explore. Uh, I really shouldn't sell this, but we're already full. It's dumb. For the separation between the original dungeon divers has occurred, the divide is clear, the divide is distinct. On one side you have the adrenaline-fueled, glory-seeking danger junkies. This group calls themselves heroes. On the other side you have the merchants. These responsible, the, f these responsible ones view the dungeon diving as a job. Less about the glory, more about finding and the most valuable item and getting out of there as quickly as possible. At your point, they will set up shop in their own town. The goodies for sale. One is possibly braver than the other. The other possibly and more intelligent, but I'll just let you conclude. And now we gotta get away. So we already found the way out, so I don't even really mind. It's a little disconcerting that lava starts flowing behind you on the door. It's more disconcerting than the door slamming shut behind you. Alright, so... So, things we can do to give us more space, I think this qualifies for now. Well, that 10 damage is better than the damage we could have taken, so...
Magnetite seems good. Anything that's gonna destroy some curses, that seems good. Uh, unfortunately, I think I need to destroy the curse on this. Okay, I, I need you all to just behave for a minute here. Because this will cure that and then stack on top of it. And the only problem is that technology stuff that we got is basically never going to be useful. Like it's, or it's, it's stack is always going to be a problem. Data entry 125, according to this month's report, the most valuable items are being left untouched in our warehouses. Only tools and materials used to build our autonomous guards are taken. I think we've already seen that one. Okay, um, I think it might be time to leave. Destroys one artifact upon returning to town. Yeah, it might just be time to do that thing. Costs us 18,000 to portal in and out, though. It's expensive. We have still two empty spots. We took a lot of damage in that room, though. Still have two empty slots. I mean, we might as well keep exploring and then drop a portal in that room. Like, that seems like a reasonable course of action. I'm not familiar with that enemy. This thing needs to die, like right now. This is dangerous. I'm okay with my strategy here. It will take forever and a day, but I will not get murderated by this thing. Oh boy, okay, I can survive maybe one more hit from this. Okay, there's a spear. That's pretty good. Oh, 
Holy crap. I was gonna put it right in them right into that. Okay. These thermomagnetic engines seem only seem to only appear in the third floor, probably just waiting in one of these gold chests. Thermomagnetic engine. That's something I need apparently, though for what? I'm not sure. What am I getting rid of? I think I'm getting rid of these. Holy shit, I just got 3,000 gold for throwing that away. Alright, we're probably not going to get healed for all that much, so... Yep. Let's make that portal. Yoink! All right, we didn't actually even kill that much. Oh, we got the animation of all the things turning around. All right, that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, we're going to do some selling. It's nighttime. Why is it nighttime? Is it because we died? Probably. I wanted to open this one. Okay, what did we need that magnetic engine for? I, I kind of want to know. You looking to craft some gear, Will? Those I really should craft. Gotcha. I need three of those. And then I can make this sword. And to make the better bow, I also need those. Okay. I think I really need to focus on armor, though. At least for now. Unfortunately, to upgrade all my armor, I'm going to need a crap ton of money. But yeah, it's nighttime, which means I guess we're just going back. Which is just weird. Alright, well. That's still going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you next time. But until then, keep your gears turning.